Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to be shining up our headlights with the 3M compound and hand glaze. Uh, this method works really good. As you can see, the headlight on this 07, they're completely dead, dull. Uh, I could obviously sand them down and clear them and have the proper factory look. The problem is not everybody's going to be able to do that. So this method is just an easy way to order some stuff online and do it yourself. You could order the 3M compound on Amazon. You could order the hand glaze on Amazon. It's like 30 bucks or 20 bucks for a bottle. And then what you do is you could either do it by hand with a microfiber cloth, what I'm doing right now, or you could buy the attachments that go to a 12 volt hand drill or power drill. And basically what it is, is you attach it to it right there. And then those little contraptions right there are basically like having a big buffer only for small jobs like this. Put a little bit of compound, you buff it with a little machine and you're gonna get the same results, maybe even better. Uh, it's a little harder to do it with your hand because you gotta put a little power to it. But that video right there will show you how easy it is in a sense like, you know, you just gotta put a little pressure on it. Anybody can do it. You don't have to buy anything. So if you don't own a power drill, and you don't have the access to getting one then just buy the compound microfiber rags and then uh, go at it as you can see when I started you couldn't even see my reflection on this particular headlight and now you can I've noticed that with the factory headlights it works a hundred times better you know obviously because of the material that they use from the factory versus the aftermarket but because this element my 07 has factory headlights I don't want to replace them and I don't want to sit there and take them apart and clear them. Like once again, you know, I'm trying to show, I guess, make a video about how you could do this real easily. Depending on where you live, uh, it probably will last about maybe a year to two years before you have to do it again. So it's not a bad investment in time and in money. Because if you think about it, I've, I've we used to charge like 150 to 200 to do headlights. Uh, this is back in the day. I don't know what they charge now. But you can see the results. It's really nice. You come back in with some hand glaze, it kind of protects it. And then if you really want a lot of protection or you want to keep it really nice and clean, put some wax on it. Put some buttermilk wax or something that has a silicone in it. Because the silicone wax will kind of protect it a little better from the UV light or UV you know, rays from the sun, whatever you want to call it. And it'll keep it shinier. Also, whenever you wash your car, after you wash it, you can come back every time with this hand glaze because it's not a wax and you know it doesn't harm anything. It's just glazing everything off and reshining it or taking off the, I guess the rust or oxidation, whatever it is that they call it. But you get a unique clean look and it only takes four or five minutes. Basically the length of this video is what it took me to clean both of my headlights, one of them fully from beginning to end and the other one to glaze it. So it's not a bad deal. It's not a bad investment. Check it out. Look it up on Amazon. Uh, like I said, it's like 30 or 40 bucks for a bottle. And then if you want to buy the attachments for your drill, you can. I'll put the link on the uh, descriptions below. But uh, it works pretty good. Uh, gives you amazing results. You, just the front end alone will look nicer when you do this. I guarantee you. All right, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe, hit the like, leave some comments. Let me know what you think. And check out the online store for the new merchandise, new t-shirts, and uh, some of the uh, stuff that we uh, put up there. And thanks for watching. And once again, remember, stay in your element. Y'all be good. Take it easy out there and uh, drive safely. Y'all be good.